Socrates is talking to some interlocutor who thinks he knows the meaning of some very familiar term like friendship or courage or piety or something of that kind. And by simply quizzing him, by interrogating him, by submitting him to what's become known as Socratic questioning, Socrates shows this person they don't at all have a clear grasp of this concept. These very works are still very widely used to teach philosophy and to introduce philosophy to people who want to know something about it. You start with a familiar and important. It's always a concept that's important in our life. And you get people to realize that there are problems in that concept. They try to think about it. They produce an answer. Socrates shows the inadequacy of the answer. You end up not with a firm answer, but with a much better grasp of the problem than you had before. And you, the reader, are left drawn into the problem and wanting to get the answer and feeling that perhaps you can.